Hi everyone, this is Jay Harris coming to you from Tom's Trading Room. I have an updated video for you here, an updated process on how to find and download the Penny Pilot list of stocks that Tom's talked about in the past. There is a new process than the old way that was shown and one of our newer students found that video, tried to do the process and found out that that doesn't work anymore. So here's what we want you to do for finding the Penny Pilots. What you want to do is type in CBOE Penny Pilot List in a search window. Then go ahead and when the uh, page populates or when you search up the, the, the listing of all the URLs to the sites that may have that information, I want you to find the one that says Options Penny Pilot MIAX. Click on that. It will go to the CBO uh, list. Well, actually, it goes to the MyAx page, and you can see the URL for that, myaxoptions.com slash options hyphen penny hyphen pilot. And you can see it says Options Penny Pilot, and it tells you right here it's a participant in an industry-wide pilot program that provides for the quoting and trading of certain option classes in penny increments, hence the Penny Pilot program. So here we are. You can go to the MyAx Options Penny Pilot class list. Left, excuse me. Left click on that. Click open. And when that spreadsheet opens up, you'll see it right here. There's the underlying ticker, the underlying name. Now, if you want to go ahead and copy all of these, just simply left click and drag down through all of the ticker symbols here. And this has been shown on a previous video as how to take a list from outside of the tools and export it into the tools. So you left click and highlight all of them, right click, left click on copy, go back to the tools, and you can go into website, lists, and edit list. And you see here that I have the edit list name for new name. It's generally defaulted to my penny and weekly. That's already in there. But let's just say you wanted to include these into a new list for yourself. I'm going to show you that you don't have to because we have these lists in there and we update them at least twice per year. But nonetheless, let's go ahead and go back to that list number. If you don't have all of your lists already named, here's one that says new name. I'll leave it that for now. I'm going to right click in the edit symbols box and click paste. And you'll see all the ticker symbols are in there, but I want to go ahead and left click on save so that it restructures them here and it shows 355 stocks. And there's all the ticker symbols up above as well as in the box and in the stock names down below here. You can go ahead and type a new name for that and then click save and it'll refresh the page and it'll have this list saved with the new name. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to show you however though we do have the penny pilot uh, stocks in the list already for you. We have in the pre-computed symbols box down here, you see penny plus weekly, penny and weekly, and then the separate list penny stocks and the weekly stocks. And the distinction here is the pennies and weeklies are the penny stocks that are also weeklies. And then the penny plus weeklies are the penny wide spread stocks added to all the stocks that are weekly. So it's just kind of the combined list of the two. So there you are, folks. Real quick and easy, just go ahead and type in CBOE Penny Pilot List. Click on the link for the MyAxOptions.com site. You'll find the list right there or the CSV uh, spreadsheet you can download as well and do with it whatever you like. That's the updated way to find the Penny Pilot List, folks. We will talk to you soon on future videos.